dear friends as you may be aware that uh, the pilonodal sinus occurs in the gluteal cleft and is uh, because of the impaction of air tufts in the pseudoriferous glands therefore it uh, occurs commonly in the adults where the secretion of the pseudoriferous gland is more and uh, as the age advances the chances of palinodal sinuses becomes less so this is uh, the primary opening from where actually the palinodal sinus starts by impaction of the hair so prior to the procedure we usually clean the hair and then and then and then uh we give the local anesthesia at the level of the primary opening another injection is given at uh, the secondary opening actually where the pus forms now we put the probe in the pilonodal sinus and you can see that the probe comes out from other opening so this is the track now we put a plain thread at the initial sitting in the pilonodal sinus and put a thread in the probe any remaining hair should be removed and after removing the probe the thread is in c2 so we tie the thread in the pilonodal sinus and the subsequent alkaline thread or uh, shara sutra was replaced by rail load method so this procedure need minimum infrastructure and it is day case procedure and patient can go to the daily routine after the procedure thank you very much